It's a cold winter morning in Grundy Center, Iowa, and Mrs. Lindemann's third grade Spartans are on time, fit for duty, and ready to learn. Just like ancient Spartan children, Grundy Center children respect their teachers, work as a team, and they want to grow strong, upright, and brave. Their theme this year is thinking bodies, and one of their goals is better posture and body mechanics. Chairs and desks were adjusted to fit, and students now use adapters on their chairs and slant boards on their desks. Mrs. Lindemann is teaching them how to sit well and in comfort. They use about 22 degrees of desk angle at about 60 degree of hip, and they also take body mechanics breaks. Here are a few physical literacy exercises they are learning. This exercise helps unlock their ribs and widen their shoulders so they can breathe better. This is the archer. It's a tough one to learn. Students aim at important things they want to work on and say ping when the arrow flies. This is a great action-based reminder that keeps them focused on a higher and noble purpose. Mr. Shupak is the Spartan physical education teacher. He knows what good posture looks like and he inspires his young Spartans to think about it. But thinking alone isn't enough, so his students use gravity to improve their posture and move more efficiently. These are some Spartan fourth graders. Wall-supported inversion is fun and builds muscles. Leaning backward properly feels great after sitting in the classroom. They do it very slowly, gracefully, and carefully. They are also maintaining their ability to squat. Scientists say squatting properly is important for lifelong mobility, and these young Spartans are determined to keep it. Mr. Shupak's special high bar lets them train off the ground all year round. The fourth graders are also learning how to spot and coach their partners so they can safely practice more demanding progressions together on the playground. In this class, the fourth graders learned how to use inversion boots. This exercise is called three-point brachiation, and brachiation means hanging from the limbs. Applying their climbing skills under playful pressure is great fun for these young Spartans. This is an escape adventure. Skill and stealth are critical here. They move quickly, but carefully. Physical literacy is an integral component of the Grundy Center school experience. Spartan teachers, administrators, students, and parents all value physical and motor fitness education. They also understand that posture and dynamic balance are the foundation of human movement, and motor skills are critical for brain development and academic success. Back in the classroom, it's a very special day because Mrs. Lindemann's students are going to learn the Star Spangled Banner. First, they learn the history, and it is as interesting as any video game. They stood on the deck of a British ship with American detainee Francis Scott Key while British cannons pummeled Fort McHenry on the shores of Baltimore all through the night 200 years ago this year in 1814. The Spartans knew almost all of the words in the song, but they still added six more to their vocabulary. Then the song made sense. This is their third try at singing the Star Spangled Banner. It's already beautiful, but they will improve with time and always remember the important story behind the song. It's like that with posture and body mechanics. If we teach our children to move efficiently and gracefully when they are young, and we fuel it with higher and noble purpose, we won't have to encourage them to move often as they grow older. That's the Spartan way, and our children deserve no less.